Hello everyone, welcome back to another video today and this video is a preview for the massive clash this weekend between Tottenham and Arsenal, North London derby, Jose Mourinho against Arsenal. So this is a very enticing fixture and this only brings up one question that can Arteta outmaster Jose Mourinho or will Jose deepen Arsenal woes even more? So we start the video by looking into the previous fixture that these sides have faced against each other. So the last 8 matches between the sides has seen Tottenham on the victorious side 3 times while 3 have been draws and 2 have been Arsenal victories for Arsenal. So this was thing we could not have, never have expected before 10 years back in 2005-10 when Arsenal used to be a dominant team. But now the gap is slowly and slowly closing. Especially the last 2 matches, one was a 2-2 draw when Pochettino was still the manager and Tottenham threw away a 2-0 lead while other was a Jose Mourinho win where he won 2-1 against Arsenal at home stadium. So the facts in this picture are that Arsenal haven't won at Tottenham Stadium at since 2014 when they secured a 1-0 victory. Lacazette has scored against Tottenham in the last 2 matches both sides have faced against each other. Aubameyang has 3 goals in his 4 matches against Tottenham while Harry Kane has also 3 goals against Arsenal in his last 4 encounters all 3 though have been penalties. So now we move on to Arsenal's biggest nightmare and that is Jose Mourinho and especially facing him at away grounds. Whenever Jose has been at home, whether at Chelsea, whether at United and whether one match at Spurs, he has got 10 matches against Arsenal from where he has won 6 and he has drawn 4. This is not a good reading if you are an Arsenal fan and know how much trouble Jose causes when he faces Arsenal. This ends the previous encounter stats and everything, now we move on to injury news. For Tottenham, Toby Alderweireld was ruled to be out for 2-3 weeks last week because Jose Mourinho said he suffered a serious injury against Manchester City. But Jose Mourinho has confirmed that Toby Alderweireld has returned to training and you never know he might be back in the lineup. While Eric Lamela will remain out for this match, so he will be out for 1-2 weeks more. So this was a Tottenham injury news. While Harry Kane, a big news is Harry Kane is also doubtful for this encounter but I think he will be back. Harry Kane cannot miss a North London derby. So now we move on to Arsenal and Arsenal have Karam Chambers and Gabriel Martinelli who are out with long term injuries while Pablo Mari has returned to the squad against Rapid Vian but I think he will be in the squad in this match but this could be too early especially in a high intensity Premier League game. Along with that Arsenal, Thomas Partey Reno has been out, Nicolas Pepe could be out with suspension. So Thomas Partey could be a very very big for Arsenal and David Lewis might be doubtful for this match because of the horrific head clash he had with Raul Jimenez. So I think this was an injury news for both the sides. Now we move on to the lineup that we can expect both the sides to play. So let's straight away go first of all to Tottenham. So with Tottenham, I expect Tottenham to play. We know that they will line up with Hugo Lloris as a keeper. I expect them to go with Sergi Aurier because Sergi Aurier has been very good against big teams and there is no reason to drop him out of the lineup. So I think they will go with Serge Aurier at the right. The Gullian will keep his plate as a left as we know. In the middle, it will be I think it will be Joe Rodden and it will be Eric Dyer. In the midfield, it will be Hodgeberg and then you will have in the midfield Sissoko. While Endembole will be playing a bit more top in the midfield while Son, Kane and Bergwijn take the other spots. People still want to see Bale but I think Jose is slowly and slowly easing him in. So I don't think that we should expect Jose Mourinho to play Gareth Bale so early. So I think this was the Tottenham lineup. Now we move on to Arsenal lineup. And with Arsenal, we all know that first of all, Arsenal will have Leno as a keeper. I think Arsenal will play three at the back in this match. So it will be Tierney, it will be Holding, and it will be Gabriel with Leno. While I think at the right, it will be Hector Bellerin. At the left, it will be Saka. And in the middle, because Thomas Partey is missing, but, but Arsenal needs some bodies, I think it will be Granit Xhaka and Mohamed El Neni. While at the top, I expect them to in this match because of the way Lacazette plays in the big games to Lacazette be in the middle, Aubameyang taking the left spot and Willian taking the right and remember Willian is one player that Tottenham always fear to play. So Willian will be a must in this encounter and Willian always steps up for the big encounters. So this was about the lineup. now we move on to prediction. What can happen? Will Tottenham remain top of the league? Will Tottenham send a statement to Arsenal that we are the one who are taking over North London and we are in the title race while you will be fighting to get in the top 8, top 9? Or is this the match where Arsenal remove all the bad things they've done this season and get her head in the table? Arsenal are only 8 points behind Tottenham so a victory can put them 5. But will they do it? No. 
if Thomas Partey was available, I could have said that this match could easily end nil nil because Mikel Arteta will be defensive and Thomas Partey will really help them mid- win the midfield battle. But sadly, there's no Thomas Partey. Arsenal have a goal in them. They will concede a goal 100%. Granit Xhaka could be exploited. Then holding can be exploited. So they will concede a goal and Thomas Partey's presence could have really avoided that. But sadly, he won't be present. And Hodgeberg and Sissoko are two players who will not allow Obama and Lacazette will in a lot of spaces. So sadly, with the creativity that Arsenal have showed this season and how lack of creativity they have, if they're not going to score a goal, especially with the defence, I think Tottenham are going to win this match 1-0. They won't be able to keep Tottenham out and sadly they won't be able to score against such a tough structure that Jose Mourinho has. So Jose Mourinho is going to get another victory and is really going to increase his dominating record over Arsenal. So I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave your prediction in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and please like, share and subscribe.